Welcome everybody again to uh, this uh, thing, ninth or tenth edition of um, what is it called? The Objective C podcast series of interview with uh, yet another speaker uh, from uh, uh, that will be uh, at Objective Cologne um, in September. If you have the impression you've seen this guy already, you're wrong. You have seen a guy who kind of looked like him, uh, and it might be because it's 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 uh, it's twin water. So this isn't Ken, this is Glenn. So who are you? Now that I introduce you already. Uh, my name is, is Glenn Aspasley, and I'm half of Ecamm Network. Did you, by we the way, did you, did you watch the interview with Ken about the discussion? No, I, I forgot to watch the interview with Ken, sorry. No, the reason why I ask you is because of the discussion about your last name. And ah. the way I thought we were supposed to pronounce it and the way I heard Ken for the first time ever pronounced it and I realized I've always pronounced it as plus lag yeah. and um, long story short you guys are probably gonna stay here uh, longer than expected in Germany because you're gonna discover that you are finally from where I live ah, I, I hope I hope we can go over to the to the, the old Aspersle manor to the good Aspersle which is uh, about 12 kilometers away from my home, which is, by the way, about 30 kilometers away from uh, uh, the place where Objective Cologne is going to happen. Nice. Um, by the way, before that we get into your interview, I have a very good, uh, amazing announcement to announce, which by the time the video is online, people have seen it on the website, but if they don't, they should check out the website. I have uh, uh, signed, or I'm about to sign, uh, the, the 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 dinner organization in the evening uh, which is going to be organized at a place called uh, Küchenloft and uh, Kochschule so it's a school it's it's a place where they sell kitchen they also give um, uh, 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 cooking courses and um, it's a, a pretty amazing chef that's gonna um, cook for us uh, in the evening um, and yeah I think it's gonna be awesome uh, it's a uh, and it's a block away from uh, from the conference center so the evening isn't going to be at the conference center it's going to be a block away from that at a, a, a place which is almost uh, which is at least as awesome as uh, the alte versteigungshalle is so um i asked you both of you guys ken and you uh to come over speak at objective cologne uh because uh, i had uh, seen that you had given us uh, as as well a talk and uh so I um, ask you to make each one a talk, and uh, I'm going to ask you the same question I ask uh, Ken, which is, why did you accept to uh, my invitation to come over and speak at Objective Cologne? Um, I th it, was, it was pretty easy to decide whether we wanted to go. I mean, you know, it, it sounds like a really cool conference. I mean, it's run by you. We know you're cool. But, um, we hope you can put on a good conference for us. Um, and um, it's in. It sounds like it's in a cool location, and I've never been to Germany. Um, and it, I, I took a look at the, the the rest of the speakers. They sound like pretty cool guys. Yeah. And um, we decided we could go over and um, and speak for you. Um, looking also looking forward to participating in the conference, um, listen, hearing the other talks, and meeting all the people. Mm -hmm. Cool. It's um, I, I'm, I hope I can r reach those expectations that everybody say it's cool, it should be cool, blah blah blah. I'm, I'm doing everything I can, uh, and um, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be awesome because of uh, you guys, the speakers, but also because of the attendees. I still I had a few um, attendees sign up also the last days, and I hope we're gonna reach a point where I I can totally smile right now. I cannot totally. Somebody's calling uh, here, and it's even internally. So I'm gonna let the phone ring. Um, uh, but um, so the next question is actually your talk uh, is gonna be a little bit different than ten than Ken talks, I think. Yeah, Ken's going for a, a tech talk. Yeah. Um, I am. Um going to give a talk that we, um, a, a kind of a new version of a talk that we gave in, uh, in Denver okay. um, at, the, at the NS Conf. It's, a, it's, a, it's about um, making... At the, at the, I, I think you're at the I360 Conf or something like that. You said NS yeah, Conf. whatever it's called. Three, 360, 360 Mac Dev in Denver. Okay. And um, it's going to be about making apps and um, 
kind of taking all of our experience of the past 10 or so years and trying to package it up into a, some useful tidbits of advice for um, iOS developers and Mac developers um, and see if we can kind of uh, both get developers excited mm -hmm. about making apps and selling them and um, tips on how to sell more apps. And um, <laughs> I'm about to die. Um, this is... Um... This is the thing. Um, the thing you work more at Ecamm, right? You 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 split the roles. Uh, um, you you code a little bit, but you you do less code than Ken does, right? Yeah, I'm I'm definitely doing less code these days. Um, Ken tends to be more on the um, the low level technical side, kind of making the magic happen. And um, I've been working on. Um, on phone view mostly right, um, the last couple months, okay. but even still, when I need something really kind of um, magical to happen, I'll I'll, I'll have Ken do it yeah. for me. Um, and I, I also do um, the marketing and um, communication with um, business development. Yeah, we, we could speak forever with you. That's the problem, either with you or with Ken. I could do a podcast for the next twenty hours because, for a different reason, one of those being we have so many things to to. Uh, to tell the people so many stories we have been living, uh, I would say, together over the past. We know each other for, I think, like six years or something like that. One of those stories is, um, we were just discussing about that uh, before. Um, I just got this brand new uh, Retina MacBook Pro here, which is pretty cool. The non-cool thing, though, is some software aren't Retina ready. Luckily, Call Recorder, which I'm using right now, which I can only recommend, is totally um, retina ready. And you were telling me, actually, it's funny because you were helped by a banner you had to put together a few years ago for the Mac world, right? Yeah, um, we had a. Um, just a, for those who don't really um, haven't looked into this yet, I mean, for all your Mac apps, you'll have to create um, 2x graphics just like you did for iOS. And um, we realized that we had made some 100 20x, yeah. 100, yeah, 20 or 30x graphics yeah. um, for a giant wall-sized call recorder poster. So we had to take our call recorder UI and, yeah. and turn it into a, a vector graphic. So we were actually able to use that graphic from, um, from Macworld 2009 mm -hmm. to um, create vector graphics for call recorder. Yeah. And um, it was pretty easy. We just swapped in a bunch of... Um, double resolution TIFF files. And so actually you are ready for when uh, a super mega retina display is going to come in 10 years because you already have the, <laughs> the, the yeah, 20x. We could, do, we could do 4x, yeah. 8x, 16x. Yeah. Um, and by the way, I'm seeing in the in the back here of the of the camera, at least of one of those cameras that I have, I don't know if we can see that, but I have a bunch of lanyards laying here on those banners uh, from Objective Cologne, and this is kind of my inspiration. I've been working on the lanyards. Um, every detail for the conference is very important, and you don't even imagine how, ma how many time I've spent, together with Martin, by the way, my developer, Martin Winter, which is an amazing bloke. Um, on, on lanyards. Um, okay, um, the next question is actually, we have spoken already about the, um, a little bit about, we have touched on, on, on how you imagine the conference is going to be. Um, have you, as you said, it's for your first time in Germany, although to be honest, you, you're not going to be totally immersed in Germany because this is, uh, first of all, you don't stay that long, which is sad, just um, as long for the conference, plus a trip to Gut Aschposchlag to discover your origins. Uh, this is probably where you're going to realize, dude, I'm German, I'm staying here. Uh, um, but how do you imagine the conference is going to be? How do I imagine it's going to be? Yeah. I think it should be fun. <laughs> That's, I, I, I like mean, that word. <laughs> if, if, if you're looking for me to try and sell the conference to a bunch of prospective conference goers, I mean, this is going to be the event of the year. <laughs> And it's happening right there in Germany. It's going to be, um, I mean, just take a look at the speaker list. Take a look at the attendee list. If you click through, um, you pretend like you're going to buy on the website, you can see the attendee list there. Yeah. Um, there's tons of cool people going. Um, it's going to be, if, and if you've never been to a conference like this before, a big part of it is, is, is meeting new people and, um, and making new contacts. And, um, and you'll get to meet the speakers, too. They're not just going to you know, show up in a in a limousine and, and give a talk and, and then leave. I mean, 
they'll be part of the conference too. Speaking about limousine, um, I'm not going to order limousines, but I'm going to try to have. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. It's the Get first it. the first year, maybe for the second year. Uh, but um, I'm going to try to put uh, like uh, one or two speakers uh, per table during the dinner so that everybody has because i know how it is in conference i've been myself to different conferences and i've, I've been in some conferences kind of a small tiny speaker or i give some time talks and um, i know a little bit more the other side the attendee side and sometimes you don't um you don't know how to go to the speakers and there is even though we are close to each other there is some kind of barrier so i want people to eat together to have uh, good wine together to uh drink together uh I'm, I'm i'm making sure by the way um that uh that uh that the drinks are a uh, flat rate um i don't want people to um um be worried about uh how much am i gonna how much uh am i gonna drink or something like that i, I don't want people to be drunk uh but i don't want people to carry around a, a wallet and, and things like that so um so I hope people can uh, communicate and and uh, and uh, yeah start the second day hopefully fresh but also uh infused with a lot of inspiration from the day before. The second day doesn't start till noon, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Actually, I'm thinking about this. There is still I'm still unsure about the second day first session. And um yeah, we might start later actually. We'll see. We'll see. There will be a there will be a second day, right? There will be a second day, and 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 I will be there. Uh, yeah, I will I will emerge uh, on the second day. You're, you're gonna show up. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna show up okay. both day. I'm probably gonna I'm 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 gonna sleep at the conference to be sure to be there. <laughs> We're not sleeping far away, by the way. At least uh, all of us. Hey, yeah, you're rent, you're renting this place out. You might as well get your money's worth by. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, there. yeah. That's that's kind of it. Yeah. All right. Thank you uh, very much for uh, being with me. Uh, thank you for being with us. And uh, it's like in yeah, it's like in six weeks now. By the way, it's coming up next week. Next week, I've got my baby, my real one, coming up. Uh, oh. Baby number three, and uh, and a month later, I have my uh, virtual baby number one, being Objective Cologne, and I can't wait to see you guys. All right, I'll be there in my in my red and green T-shirts. Oh yeah. Oh, by the way, yeah. Yeah, Objective Colorings t-shirt, yeah. All right, bye-bye, Ken. See you soon. See you later. Cheers. I'm Glenn, by the way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're Glenn, by the way. True. <laughs> Let me see if this was aimed at me. That was a good good way to end, right? Bye-bye, Ken. That was a great way to end.